Assalamu alaikum viewers. Me and my friends have initiated an effort to help the students, particularly the planning students, to get awareness about different softwares and their operations and applications in field. The software which you will be aware of today is ODK. ODK is abbreviation of Open Data Kit. It's a free software, an open set of tools which help organization author, field and manage mobile data collection solution. In ODK, we built a data collection form or server. We collect data on mobile device and send it to a server and aggregate the collected data on a server and lastly extract it in useful formats. We can also incorporate geographical position. The important thing here is we are not using paper and pen anymore for surveys. So here we go. Open your browser write ODK in the search engine and click enter. It will give the results by giving different links. Click on the first option which is opendatakit.org. You see the home page is open with introduction to ODK and the three steps build, collect and aggregate. Click on the first option to build the data collection form or survey. You need to have an account to work on Go to the second option for sign in or sign up. You see that it is asking for sign in. If you don't have an account yet, click on don't yet have an account to make your account. As I have already an account, I will use date. Username Najaf and then the password. Then I will sign in. After sign in, this kind of page will open with five options in toolbar. The first one is to rename the form which we are going to make. Click on the rename and name it as I am giving it a name sample 01. Looking downward, you see the options which we can include in our form like text, numeric, date time media like pictures and many more the right portion is telling the properties of the question data or media the things gonna be included there and below it is giving the further information about it if i start with a text you see different boxes are open in properties the first one is data name not that it will not be visible in exported data the thing which is going to be visible in the form is the label. Write the information here which we are required. I will write the full name of respondent. It is becoming dominant in the left side you see. Now here is asking either this info is required or read only. Means if it is required you cannot skip it while filling the form I made it required after this suppose we need a numeric information then click numeric on the lower part fill the properties in data name I write the age reminding again it it's not visible and the label portion ask the thing which you are required I made this question also re required now in numeric you can set the range tick the valid range i write 18 in the minimum it is now asking should i be should it be inclusive means 18 is also included or not i take it inclusive it must be included now for question like multiple options and selecting on click on choose one option for generating related questions and then the data I write qualification label it I write qualification of respondent and the third portion I write education as hint like educational qualification is required thing take it also among the required means you cannot skip it you see what the things gonna be in this option I write primary 
then add the second option middle and third metric fourth option graduation and sixth diploma or others now to include locational information click on location option below name data label it write coordinates here and style select the default GPS so that you get the coordinates now after doing all this thing go to the file and from here save it and it is now saved go to the export and export to XML which will be the readable in Excel and download it the download is complete you see our form is now downloaded in XML form the next thing here is to open this downloaded file in mobile for conducting the survey for this concern open data kit web page and click on the second option which is collect the data on mobile device and send it to a server as we are opening it on our smartphone we need to download the related app from play store first the description about how to download it is given so we need to go to play store on our smartphone first search ODK collect in search bar the application is here now install it it is downloading now yes download it now open it to get the main menu if you select the first option that is fill blank form it will say nothing available to display so you need to connect your mobile phone with the PC empty right now the data are the form which we created in ODK online is with us in downloaded form so copy it and paste to the folder of ODK the form folder now open ODK collect app on your phone go to fill blank form here we see the sample 01 which we have already sent from our laptop the form was created online if you remember so open it you see the first thing it's asking is full name of respondent as we had said it while making the form write the name here suppose I write Najaf age of respondent is the next question if I try to skip it it won't skip because we set this question as required while making the question for form write the age over here like 20. the next question is the multiple choice question you need to select one among them select suppose intermediate next is the coordinate or the location information we want so it will take some time to give the location here we add our location and coordinate with accuracy level after filling all the question this kind of page will appear you have to make this form as finalized and save and exit so form successfully saved similarly information about other respondent repeat the same thing go to fill blank and write the name of for example I write Sakib age of respondent uh, say I write uh, 18 qualification level uh, I think graduation then the coordinates it will take some time
and lastly save it we have the uh, we have saved the form now we need to collect the data on server and extract in useful format for this purpose open orik data kit from the website click on the aggregate option scroll down here you see that for installing an app engine we need to have a java 7 which will act as a moderator and read the language so the link is shared here all you need to do is download it from the link free java download go to windows offline 64 bit which is perfect for my pc and download it now java is downloaded install it now it will take some time so you need to be patient yes it successfully downloaded You see some instructions and guide are also given on the page of Open Data Kit about the aggregate. You need to go to the home page again and click on downloads. On the right side you see the brief guest toggle. Click on it and download it and save. It is being downloaded and it's saved now. Audio Care B phrase is downloaded. Now open it. You see it is in executable form. Now you need to do is link your phone and go to the ODK folder and open the folder of instances. Here are the samples we created already on mobile phone. Copy the folder and paste it to the folder where we kept where we kept ODK briefcase. Open the briefcase. You see the first option of pull data from. From here, change it to the custom path to ODK directory and link the samples. The samples which we created already with mobile. They are in ODK folder, so I link the ODK folder and choose it. Mark the sample 01 and click on the pull option. After doing this, click on the export above given. Give it a path to be saved. I'm gonna save it on the desktop, so I selected the desktop and export it. You see it is succeeded. Now I will check the desktop and sample 01 is here in excel form. Open it and see the magic. All the data which we collected through form are here in excel form. The three forms of Najaf, Sakib and Zueb are here. The full names are given, which we type on the form. The location is also given and other information are also here. Note that the qualification is was qualitative data, so it is written untitled here. And other options are also obtained and hence will be dealt. So this was an introduction to the very useful software and practicing it will give definitely benefits so that's all from ODK thank you so much for listening